The Holy Spirit was given for three reasons, and I'm going to get out of here with this. John 16, Jesus says this, The Holy Spirit was given to convict of unbelief, of righteousness, and judgment. Unbelief. He said he's given to convict uh, of unbelief, to convict the world because they do not believe. The Holy Spirit was given in Acts 1.8, according to Jesus, to empower believers to do supernatural acts, to walk in miracles, signs, and wonders so that the world would be convicted of their unbelief. Amen. So the Holy Spirit's given to empower you to live a supernatural life. Number two, he's given to convict of righteousness. Not to convict you of unrighteousness, but to convict of righteousness. Jesus said, because I go to the Father and you see me no more. The Holy Spirit now is primarily speaking to you to remind you of what the Scriptures have said, which is God has made you holy. God has made you righteous. You are now the righteousness of God in Christ. No, 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 you don't understand. He's given to convict us of what's unrighteous behavior so we can work harder to become righteous. It's never worked. Are you guys seeing this? Sorry to mess up your theology, but maybe we should use the Bible instead. And he's coming to convict of judgment. That's right. This is what religious people think. That's right. He's coming back and he's going to judge the world. No, the scripture says he's come, he, he, the Holy Spirit is here to convict of judgment because the prince of this world has been judged. Okay, Holy Spirit is given to do what then? Empower you. Yo. Develop a mindset of imputed righteousness that we live out of and to convince us of profound confidence concerning the enemy. The Holy Spirit is not given to wear you out to remind you to do better. The Holy Spirit is given so that you can live an empowered life doing miracles, signs, and wonders. So you walk around aware of the fact that you are now righteous and able to live a holy life and that you walk around knowing that the enemy is a defeated foe and that you can have absolute confidence living your life walking in supernatural power and holiness.